Yep, um, I'm the course leader for CGI and visual effects and computer games at Solent University in Southampton. And we've had a, a really exciting day today. Every, every year we have our industry week, which is this week. Um, so we're having masterclasses uh, throughout the week uh, at Solent University. Uh, we had an excellent talk from uh, Treehouse Digital yesterday. Uh, tomorrow we've got a, um, a commercial mocap session uh, with Simon Kay, who runs the mocapies website, uh, and some of our acting students, uh, along with our animation games VFX students, who are coming to that as well. Uh, he's going to teach us how to do a kind of professional mocap session using our own mocap system. And then on Friday we've got uh, um, Hutch Games, a vehicle artist from Hutch Games, coming to talk about about that. And we've got an online masterclass from Side Effects uh, on some Houdini simulations. So it's a very exciting week. But today is the most exciting bit because we're on our trip around London. Uh, and we have um, been to Clear Angle Studios at Pinewood, who do all the 3D scanning for big movies. And we've been around and seen all their secrets, which I'm not allowed to tell you. Um, we've then been to Hayes Davidson, and now we're here. So. It's been a fantastic day so far. Um, here is some of the work from this year so far. Um, just to kind of best way to introduce our course is to introduce you to some of the work from our wonderful students who are scattered around. I can't guarantee that the students here did that work. I'm sure some of them did, but there's loads of good work around. So do ask them uh, if you want to uh, find out more about what they've done. Uh, Solon is... Uh, fairly unique amongst universities in the way we invest in employability uh, and uh, industry readiness. Uh, so we recently spent about a million pounds from the Office for Students um, on uh, a 10 meter virtual production uh, wall, uh, which we uh, are using in anger already, as you can see from the photos of the students in front of it uh, doing stuff. Um, and, and our boss who left actually <laughs> a few weeks ago. Um, and you can see it's quite a good setup. It's 10 meters. We've got a two meter by three meter reflection screen above, and we've got mimic panels around for, for advanced lighting as well. So that's, that's pretty cool. Uh, and we're using that for live events. We're using that for VFX. We're using that for all sorts of uh, fun stuff at the moment. And we're actually just writing a master's program for it as well. So by 2025, we'll have a master's uh, in virtual production. Uh, we've also just been kitting out um, a um, 3D body scanner. Uh, so our visit to Clear Angle was actually really informative. We got a lot of hints and tips uh, off them. And Chris, who's floating around here somewhere tonight, is mainly responsible for building that. He's awesome. So um, he's over there. Look. Yep. Uh, if you want to find out more about that, do chat to Chris. Um, and lots of other toys as well. Um, we do believe in investing in the things that students might see when they get into industry. Um, so, for example, if you're into filming, uh, we have Arri Alexa cameras. If you're um, into uh, 3D scanning, as, as Alex is, who's also floating around somewhere today, he's over there next to Chris, um, we've, we've got um, all sorts of uh, LiDARs and... Uh, fun stuff to play with as well. So our students come to us and they get to play with everything that the best people in the industry get to play with. And most of the software as well. We do quite a lot of um, real kind of projects. So this is a film that's coming out soon called The Apocalypse Box, which our students have worked on. Um, it was actually filmed at Solent University. Uh, and how many of our students have now got IMDb credits from it? 14 of our students have now got IMDb credits from working on this, this particular film, uh, which is very exciting. Uh, and I mentioned Alex's work doing scanning. This is Fort Purbrook in Portsmouth, which uh, we've been scanning in for a research project and doing uh, um, the sort of virtual heritage uh, thing, which is also very exciting. Uh, yep. And I will hand over to the students in a minute, but if you want to get in touch with us, um, we have social media, Solent CG Magic. You do follow us because we're fun to follow. Um, you can uh, visit our portfolio site, which has each year's graduates' work up there, warts and all. Every graduate gets on there with all their CVs and stuff. Or you can just talk to us. That's us if you, if you recognize us when we're floating around. Uh, thank you. Yeah, so 
I suppose over to the students next. Well, thank you very much. I got a little bit of applause. Oh, you're so fun. Um, I, that, well, whilst whilst yeah. they're doing that, um, yeah. let's, are there any questions? For yeah, you? please. No, no, yeah, questions. Good. Okay. And, and, <laughs> no. <laughs> no, that's fine. And do well, come and talk to us afterwards if you want to know anything more. Right? Well, where is Solon? Southampton. Okay. Um, I, I do this um, talk for uh, colleges around the country from time to time, a bit bigger than this one. I went to Northampton uh, not so long ago and uh, asked them where they thought Southampton was. Um, and none of them knew. They thought it was a suburb of Northampton. <laughs> so I actually was prepared for this and I had a, ma a, a map and I got a, on PowerPoint a green square and I stuck a Google pin in the middle of the green square and wrote Northampton underneath it. And then I got another square next to it, which had the Solent and the Isle of Wight and all of the beautiful uh, blue stuff near the green stuff, and a little pin in that with the word Southampton, and they got it. So, yeah. <laughs> Ken, do, do you invite industry to come down and, and play with your talks? Oh, that's such a bone. Thank you. Yes, we do invite industry to come down. In fact, it's, it's our kind of main selling point. Aside from the industry week, which we do here, in November... We also have our CGFX event, uh, which is currently a three-day event where we have the Tuesday is for film and television courses, and we get industry people from film and television to come in. Wednesday is our local colleges outreach, where we get industry in, and we also maybe sell the courses slightly to them. Uh, and Thursday is our CGFX one, where we have uh, visual effects, games, animation uh, talks come in. Added to that, Yulia sat here coordinates a weekly guest speaker that we have from industry. So if any of you are interested in doing a talk to our students, um, contact Yulia and she will send you a Calendly link and you can book yourself in on the most convenient Thursday afternoon uh, to do a talk. But also, just before we do our um, uh, weekly talk, we also do a weekly rushes session. So any student from our course can submit any work they're doing onto Shockgrid. Um, that then gets reviewed uh, by everyone on the course. So from first years all the way up to third years, it uh, gets reviewed. Uh, the feedback goes back into the in-tray, as you would expect. And it's a great way of building creativity and passing knowledge up and down uh, from first years to third years and, and back. So, And of course, if you're interested in coming down to do a talk, um, we can also do virtual ones. But if you're interested in coming down, we'll show you around all the stuff as well, because we love showing it off. So, yes, any other questions? 